कुठे दिलेला माईक ओके प्रश्नगळ केळबहुदू माईक प्लीज Lights have to be so bright because we can't see them at all. Lights on solpa light, please. Thank you. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Much? Oh, I can see people there. Hi. Hey, hi. Namaskara. Namaskara. Ha. Prashni Shurumadana. Eli the mic. First question. Ikram. Ikram sir. That was a physical part. The mental part took longer. Mommy, I always like to get ready before the shoot and uh, we used to speak a lot and we didn't talk about my character, we spoke about other things, about ideologies, about politics regarding the movie, about the system, social inequality. And uh, what struck me then was this is not something that is, if you just see this, like when you see the song, I thought it's such a Tamil song. And then I saw it in Hindi and suddenly I was thinking, wow, it's actually like a Hindi song. When I see it in Kannada, it is a Kannada song in Malayalam. It's, I think all of us look like this at that time. We were all like this. It's just that now we've changed a little and each, each state has a different costume or whatever. So anywhere in India, I think people will be, ident will be able to identify with the story. In everybody's house, in your house, there will be a grandfather or a great-grandfather who's had something done to them during the colonial times, who'd had some form of maybe joy, maybe sadness, whatever. So everybody will be, I'm sure, able to resonate with something like this and I was taken up with all that and then getting into the character like Ranjit was always there from the very beginning it took us about two to three days before we kind of you know got into that groove wherein he didn't have to tell me ah that please don't do this don't do that and uh, it was a flow after that and uh, but it was very difficult like Malavika said she forgot the scorpions yeah, the, the funny thing is he will be shooting and he'll say hey, and then they'll just go lift one stone, then no, no, one another stone, one scorpion, one more scorpion, another stone, one scorpion. In, you won't believe in 10 minutes, sunlight pour the secret and 10 minutes they'll get a snake or they'll get a scorpion. It was that way. None of us had slippers, you didn't have clothes, so fight sequences, there was no protection. We used to get hurt, like I've, I've broken my rib during practice. I've, I, I, I couldn't walk for almost three months, first one leg. I already have a leg problem, so that got affected. Then this leg I was putting so much, that again I had a problem, I couldn't walk. I didn't tell him because he'll panic. But, and uh, that is for me, but in this gentleman here, he came in with already, he had a problem, then I mean, uh, it got worse. He had two surgeries, then he had one more, but he didn't do it because he needed more time to recuperate and we had to finish the film. So he shot with that and he went back, thought, damn good. It's over, and he went and did operate. He got operated. He was in bed, and then we get a call that we're changing the climax a little bit to make it more exciting. And we were like, <laughs> like climax is when we all fight. We all got beaten. Not again, Rajin. No, no, no. Let's shall we try? And then what he said makes sense. It was something so. It was very poetic. So, sorry, Mr. Dhananjay. So after that, he came back, and with that, he couldn't even walk. He fought. Way to go, Danny. He's, and he started eating Indian food, like he was talking to you the, uh, in, the, in the morning, and he loves all our food. He'll say, I only like fish, but then he says the whole thing. And he's now half Indian. Just a little more days, he'll be talking Tamil, Kannada, <laughs> Hindi. And um, that's it, sir. Every day, extra time do they make up? Four to five hours. And to take off, one hour. <laughs> and it was before it was two hours. Then Parvati had an idea, take basil powder and, you know, basin powder and little oil and rub it and you know like how Cleopatra used to have a bath and after that just go wash it off but that still took about one hour and there'll be dirt, there'll be ash, there'll be gold dust. It was a very, but putting on the makeup, the scars, tattoos, all of that took time. And for her it was again tattoos, she had red makeup, she had, I mean she'll tell you about her look a little later but that's it. Oh, Vikram sir, sir. you can see all the characters in this movie. Historical, police character, and other characters. Why do you think you have to do this as well? That is why they are there, no. <laughs> That's why I always say, you see, I feel Pitamagan is a character which Bala, when he thought of, he's such a great guy that 
there's no person who exists like Pitta Magni. If you actually, do you think, I mean, there are different types of people, but somebody like that who is away from society and he becomes something else, and he's a character he imagined. Likewise, in Aparjit, I mean, there is an I, there is a thing, you, there are people with that problem, but still, how to do it commercially. And then now in Tanglan, I mean, there are people, there, there have been people, in fact, all of them were Tanglans, right? So the director, when he thinks, I think, I've, every time I thought, okay, I've done only historical character, I have to do that also, I've done, I don't know what more to do, but then he comes up with Tanglan, you know, it's like that. You, you just keep, like how we are pushing boundaries, I think a director and a story writer is always trying to get, you know, across a new boundary. Uh, Ranjit sir, you are the gold of this cinema. KJP cinema is inspired by the book. You are the author of the book. You are the author of the book. You are the author of the book. Is KJP the movie? Yeah, it's a movie. Or he is asking which book you recommend. I read a lot of research work. Um, what they made about a KJP coal mine. Not only that book, Kolar Gold Mine, uh, that uh, uh, small book, it's a uh, write, uh, it's a uh, wrote by, uh, it's a uh, wrote in a Tamil Tamil language. After that, I read some English uh, articles also, and um, I uh, we made a lot of research work, lot, a lot of research work. So that then we came to know about. Uh, um, historically, what happened in KGF Kolar mine and how it's uh, people um, found that gold, uh, what is the backstory, how colonial system happened at that time, how uh, people uh, suffered trying to get a gold. So, um, and that story, you know, I, uh, it is not uh, I'm getting story. I found, uh, I uh, got a lot of research material. So, I wanted to try uh, make a story in a fa fine way. And also, people who not only um, uh, historically, uh, historically happened, uh, uh, historically happened a lot of things, but and also people have some interesting stories, uh, mythological stories. So that also excited uh, too much to me. So I trying to connect historically and also the mythologically people what they believed and uh, so uh, I, I created that whole story about that historical and mythologically so uh, it is kind it, it is came after that like kind of a, a fantasy movie so the movie it's a deal like um, the, um, uh, historical and also mythologically and uh, fantasy also so it is an interesting thing happened after that so that is Drama. I love drama, but uh, <laughs> I don't want to give yeah, drama with all the actors. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to make uh, uh, like a more drama. I just want. I just follow. Uh, I j um, what I made my movies. You no, know, it's all under realistic uh, cinema. Realistic. Uh, I'm uh, using it's very little dramas only. But um, the, in the real in real life, lot of drama happened in that uh, land. So it is not easy to uh, shoot and e e uh, easy to write and then shoot. It is too difficult. So I uh, I, I wrote a little bit. So I'm trying to make that uh, uh, that things so you can uh, connect with the drama. Yeah. Uh, this is Harshavardhan. Sorry. Hi, hi. This is Harshavardhan, sir. Uh, real incident based movies and tapandaga. This Tangalan cinema is to shekara is to uh, real in real agirate anta. Uh, percentage, um, I mean, the, the, it is deal like magical realism. It is a realism is there and also some magical also I adding something like that. So um, the movie, it is not only realistic. Uh, so people who thought about the la land know, it's a lot of uh, things happened to that. People who thought like uh, it is happened by nature and also it's happened by some ghost thing, some mysterious things happened uh, by that uh, issues. So I um, I took it. Uh, it's all uh, it's all things. So uh, so the magical thing and then the realistic uh, realistic thing also I deal it. So eighty percent magic is the uh, ma uh, so realistic is there and twenty percent is a magical realism is there. Uh, e question Vikram sir again. Uh, so, Ponin Selvan Taimal Sahana Nida question Kelita. Okay. Uh, Tangalan Anno Padadartha, only Tamilians know what is the meaning of Tangalan. As a Kanadiga, I don't know. Even I uh, don't know. Tangalan <laughs> is the name of a. What is your name? Harshavardhan. Mr. Harsh, Harshavardhan. Tangalan is like that. Okay. But Harshavardhan can be, it's a king, right? But Tangalan is, that's a community. Andre, that's uh, nativity get Takante, nativity get Takante, title yeah. change Madbodan, universal title. Yeah, but we were going with the name. It's like, 
know, like what do you say, like, like RRR or whatever. There's no, you know, it's just the name of a person. Yes, I know. But that. also, I did. Huh? Yeah, see, even Bahubali is not, it's just a name, you know. It's a character. So but it's like that. It's just a name. That it's not about the nativity. I think it's the, the it's name. It's a noun. It's a noun. Completely a noun. It's a name only. And also, we can uh, understand that uh, it's a people leader. So uh, uh, there is no need to change like uh, name, I think. People who really are easily connected, I think. And what do you call gold? Chinna. Yes? Yeah. I can't hear you. So can you give him the mic, please? Uh, gold in uh, yeah yeah yes gold. sir yes sir yeah uh, th th uh, that's how Tangalan is called. no no Tangalan is not because it's gold uh -huh. we said there's a community which is called Tangalan there's a per name called Tangalan okay but to to the year it also can certain people can hear it as gold but it's not named because of gold Tangalan is a community is it it's a name it's, no, it's, it's a, a name 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 of, name of the person uh, yes. the lead role yes sir. no no uh, you said there is a community yeah there is the also a community there's Angloridhi yeah community name also the community leader the a one community who going to lead a people you no know, we call the Tangalan so uh, we have a traditional like that there in KJF or what. In a KJF, near KJF, you know, the um, uh, district in a Velur and um, Vepur, uh, very close to that uh, Tamil areas, no. So these people, no, uh, they'll uh, call up, uh, they call a people leader, it's a Tangalan. Tangalan, it's a, it's a, uh, it's a pro, uh, proper, no proper, proper noun. noun yeah. So, okay. yeah. hi, this is Pramod Agde. Uh, apart from the place, the KGF, how can Kannada people resonate with this movie? The Kannada people also, it's a, um, um, they'll involved also uh, uh, finding, try to the gold in a colonial system and um, the three language of people deal that problem. Not only Tamilians, in Telugu and also Kannada people that um, the border, no, uh, that time, no, Warren, uh, the British colonial system happened that time, the Warren, no, uh, Warren is a British officer, he came to, um, uh, 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 not the way that he, he wants to he wants to make the borders map he wants to make the map so that time uh, so Mysore Jilla it's called in the Mysore Jilla Mysore Jilla it's, uh, um, they who speak to Mysore Jilla it's uh, people pe speak to Telugu Tamil and uh, Kannada also there is like no how separation in Bangalore you all speak all the languages so the, uh, that is an, there is no separation also in uh, Bangalore also in a lot of people is there so it is a mixed uh, community lived there so the people uh, these people easily connected that okay. Vikram sir uh, what was the reason to choose this script and uh, act in this movie does this does this intrigue you when you see these visuals what do you feel you feel there's something about it right whether you know the story or not it captivates you so that's the visually painted in my mind and for an actor this is like one, it can be scary or it can be really exhilarating. For me, it was both. Like, it was exhilarating because I thought, wow, I'm going to do it, I want to do this. It was scary because, can I do it, was, was the question. It was something that, I mean, he calls me again a hundred times for this. To make hundred parts, I will do it. Hi, sir. Uh, Lokesh from uh, News Force Canada. Another question is Ranjit, sir. Sir, Nimma cinema gali na idea lejine vera tarai rette. So illi lane lane tangala ne sangal lyrical video nor daga. One dust points borate andre. Alli nila andre. Blue flag kan sete Buddha kan sete. Illu kuda e cinema do kuda suppressed the class bage na dro matadi dera heli dera e cinema nanta story. Yeah, always uh, wanted to make a story of mine. So people who uh, affected by inequality, um, people who wants to not tell the story in that uh, so i i just wanted to tell my stories i just wanted to uh, tell a story about uh, in, uh, affected by the inequality people so um, easily you can connect with the bhavas of ambedkar ambedkar choose that color and neelam the blue so uh, and, and also buddha buddha is that uh, ambedkar choose to go that uh, buddhism also so i followed bhavas of ambedkar my thoughts uh, he taught me a lot to me and uh, so that is why my movies no always deal like I want to show like a colors like a neil, um, blue and also um, I'm trying to tell our stories uh, the people affected by the inequality so yeah this is what my all movies I'm dealing it sir i e cinema shoot aagoku madle namma kgf no ondashtu jagalige beti koti revisit madidre 
ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅಲ್ಲಿಯ ರಿಸರ್ಚ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ಎಲ್ಪ್ ಆಯ್ತು ಈ ಸಿನಿಮಾಗೆ ಜೊತೆಗೆ ಈಗ ನೀಲ್ ಅವರ ಕೆ ಜಿ ಎಫ್ ನೋಡಿದಾಗ ಈ ಟನ್ ಗಟ್ಟಲೆ ಕೆ ಜಿ ಚಿನ್ನವನ್ನು ನೋಡ್ಬಿಟ್ಟಿದ್ದೀವಿ ನಾವು ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಬಟ್ ಅದ್ರ ಆಚೆಗೀಗ ಚಿನ್ನ ಹುಡ್ಕೋ ಕೆಲಸನ ಈ ಸಿನಿಮಾದ ಮೂಲಕ ತೋರಿಸ್ತಾ ಇದ್ರಿ ಸೊ ಎಷ್ಟು ಕಷ್ಟ ಆಯಿತು ಈ ಸ್ಕ್ರೀನ್ ಈ ಸಿನಿಮಾದ ಸ್ಕ್ರೀನ್ ಪ್ಲೇ ಬರೆಯುವಾಗ ಅಂತ I already told that, so uh, Prasant Neel film is uh, totally different. So uh, he is trying to story, it's kind of, uh, he made some drama and like uh, uh, the story about uh, uh, the cage of uh, Rocky Boy. But I am trying, uh, uh, try, trying to tell the story, it's a story about uh, Tangalan, Tangalan people. So Tangalan, Tangalan people, uh, uh, what is the Tangalan, what is the Tangalan people uh, happen that time? The colonial system. the um, the problem uh, india have uh, india has um, faced a problem it's a lot about not only the freedom things it is like uh, people affected by that caste affected by that uh, suppression so um, uh, that is the thing no i wanted to try to tell that uh, uh, through that cinema and can i can i add okay thanks raji that was nicely said but uh, i want to add that this movie i mean it's very different from prashant's i mean yash's kgf that like he said it's very different but the thing is the difference is not in the way in the genre it's not just that uh, in this also like when ranjit is saying he's talking about oppression he's talking about castes and whatever the movie is not dealing with that what he's done is it is actually something else we are searching for something he's searching for something she is trying to do something to whether like stop our search or whatever that is the thing but what he's very cleverly done is he has infused all of these things the questions that you ask will be there like through the film you will know that this community or this people at that time in india all over india are facing we're facing that all of us we faced untouchability all of us the whole every the nation has thing and but that is not the story that is a vein that goes you can't shoot a film in that time suppose you had shot tanglan and it was only the search for something and not touch that it will not be real so he's created a scene it's like like titanic what is titanic about is it about the ship no it's about the love story two beautiful people they could have been in bangalore one could have been in bangalore one could have been in another state correct or not but where you put that love it could be in uh, north pole it could be in africa so like that he's put it his story is another story which he's put there but he has been true to that in the sense that everything that we are talking what you asked will all be there but it won't be yeah take it open your mouth no it's there you know that yeah that was happening you know yeah right that's happening like like now suppose let me say i come and i shoot something here i'll have to add your little maybe i can't be eating though like dosa of course you'll get here right like idli whatever that also you'll get here everybody we have the same food okay let me say like punjab i'm shooting in punjab i can't be sitting in a hotel and eating idli correct or not you'll suddenly feel odd so that idli will be there but the movie is not about the idli it's about those gundas who come to beat up this guy and this guy is trying to protect that girl and you understand so that is the way the movies but that's not i'm making it sound very light but it's not that it is a very when you see it it will affect you it will touch you somewhere but you'll won't be thinking oh god this is happening oh my god they're having pain oh my it's not that it's an exciting film it's like a crazy film like you just think like i don't know i mean i'm jumping genres genres but let's say raiders of the lost ark suppose it wasn't that time and uh, the hero i mean harrison ford is actually tangalan what could happen that's the story right thank you uh, i sir. hope i answered your question we did thanks ranjit sir ee visual nodadaga ee cinema dalli cg percent eshtide ondu eradnedu thumba tribe gal kaantare ond mur nalku bere bere tribe gal iddagide hordata fighting scene alli so avrella nijwa tribes athwa nim kalpaneya tribe ivra athwa aa kaaladalli kgf alli iddanta tribe gal anta no it's not uh, imaginary is there but uh, real people uh, uh, it's story about the real people only they uh, this people lived that time in uh, kgf so i wanted to try it's a, um, i wanted to try tell about the real people and i'm sorry i just to add to that also tangalan is from the colonial times i think you're asking because the other shot where i'm walking and all red and all that right and the others there are different generations which goes back to 2000 years back when we really don't have an idea what it was you get it i think that's what it so it's not you may think oh they, those people it's a different time altogether so there are i go through about like 10 generations in the film you understand so 
there, that difference will be there. CG? Yeah, CG is there. Yeah. CG is there, but yeah. Yeah, 10, uh, 10 percentage. I think it's a very realistic movie. We're trying to add some exciting thing and also uh, people who thought like imaginary things, lot of things and people we believed a lot of mythological story. Mythologically, it is not like a, uh, it's a realistic, right? It is kind of um, a creative process and also they had a lot of stories about an ancestor via. So, uh, that story wanted to, uh, uh, that story wanted to tell, no, uh, that story, it's a lot of dependent CG. So, uh, 20, 25 percentage, it will be, uh, uh, it is there in CG, I but think. But he felt that that has to be added because after reading the book, when he went to those places, they had these stories, no, which you wanted. Yeah. Uh, Vikram sir, Namaste sir. Uh, here, Ravi here from Kannada Picture. And Namaste, Maluika ma'am. Uh, doing commercial films and uh, doing based on two event films, what is the exact difference between the layer and uh, you people are keep on running the based on true event stories, especially uh, Vikram sir. Why exactly why? Based, I didn't understand the second part of your question. Doing commercial films and doing based on true event films, there is a, a strong layer is there. So I, I do more raw films you are saying. Yes, yes, exactly. Uh, what is the main core point no, for, you for me, people are doing as the… An, as an actor, I always felt, I was doing, even I, now I do, I do commercial cinema and I do very realistic and raw cinema, but I always will think, why not make both the films come together, you know? Why not make a realistic commercial cinema or a, like really mainstream cinema which is so real? And I think the answer is here. When you see the film, you'll understand. It is so raw, but it'll be so commercial. What is commercial? I mean, anyway, Kantara is commercial. It is commercial, but it is a raw film, right? But why is it commercial? Because it reached everybody. It's a wider range. So that becomes commercial. It's not about what genre the film is. It is how impactful or how much you reach. See, now KGF is a commercial film, but Kantara didn't start like a commercial film. But the reach was so great because you, you actually touched everybody. Everybody wants to see it. Then it becomes commercial. So like that, we, you could do anything. This movie would, we are trying to evoke, we are trying to create a situation where people will want to see this, which should make it commercial. Hi, Malvika. Uh, welcome back to Bangalore. Uh, we have seen you in 2016, Nanumatu Varlakshmi. We have seen you most of in uh, glamour roles and uh, uh, girl next door roles. No, now you are doing a de glam tough role. So how challenging for you to accept this role and uh, to prepare to this character? Like you said, I was, um, most of the offers I was getting also were uh, uh, a certain, certain genre of films, which, which is lovely. Like I, I want to continue doing that. But I was, I was hungry to, you know, I wanted to, um, some of the, some of my favorite actresses, I have grown up watching, I have grown up uh, loving um, Shri Devi, Shobhana Ma'am, Urvashi, uh, Malayali actress, um, uh, so, so Madhuri Dikshit, so many of them have, they've played such a, their filmography is so versatile. They've played so many diverse roles, you know. Um, and at the end of the day, that's the only way to grow. That's the only way to get better. That's the only way to explore yourself as an actor, to reach different kinds of people, do different genres of films. You do just one type of film or one type of role, it gets boring and you also like don't explore. Um, so I was at a stage where I wanted to work with good filmmakers um, and, and play well-written and really interesting roles directed by a good maker. Um, and it was at that point, like I keep saying that, uh, you know, this, this film came my way, we crossed paths and I was just, I was like, I, I want to do this. Um, I did have a thought initially, the first time I got into the get up, in, into the makeup and I looked into the mirror and I was like, who is this, you know, I, how are people going to react to, people are so used to seeing me a certain way that that thought did cross my mind, but it was a very fleeting moment. And the moment I got on set and I realized the caliber of what this role could be, what the ways in which is going, in going to challenge me, I, I never had that thought again. It was just about cracking the character right, um, being opposite um, 
uh, someone like um, Vikram sir, like physically we had a lot of action sequences together and he's so fierce on screen, so powerful, so all the superlatives basically, he's all of that. To match up to that power in terms of physicality was so hard for me. I'm a very girly girl, you know. Uh, I've never done stick fighting in my life. I've never done ac an action role. To, to play the stunts, to, to bring in that power in a believable way, that was one of my biggest challenges. And if I didn't get that right, nobody would have believed that she's able to hit him. You know, it will look fake on screen. So I loved how ch it was very hard. Yes, I had a lot of meltdowns on set. Uh, <laughs> there were days I was like, I, I, I don't know if I'll be able to do this. Uh, but here we are today, so close to release. And I, am, I, I hope that I've done a good job. Um, so it, it's, it's, it's a character that it's a, it's a character that I, like the kind that I always wanted, that, that serendipitously just, just, just came my way at the, you know, at the right time. Thank you, thank you so much. Last, okay, one day, Nimsha. Koneya Prashne, one the Prashne. I are to kill it, Koneya Prashne. In that period, all of us look like that only. <laughs> Anywhere in the world, even in Africa, we look like that. South America, we look like that. <laughs> no, you, sir, you will have a question, sir. I will not go without you asking me a question. Yes. Any of so he's not finished, sir. So that is, that is the thing. It's a commonality with everybody. And uh, that's a great film, of course. Uh, but honestly, I feel ours is very different. I would like to say it's better, but I won't. <laughs> it's, it's a very, because that's my, our baby. So that's what I'll feel. But it's, it's a very different film. It's like, like, see, you're actually asking, is it like KGF also, right? KGF, no, I'm saying, is it, no, no, not you, not you. Someone was saying, no, I'm saying, were we inspired from KGF? Because KGF is, when you see it, you know they're different films, right? So when the doubt comes there, when you have two people not wearing clothes, you'll think obviously there is a similarity, I'm saying. Thank you. How oh, sweet. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Vikram, sir. Last, last question. So, sir, one sec, sir. Gentleman. No. Yes, sir. The producer, sir. So, he's also a producer on this film, sir. <laughs> Sorry, sir. No, now you. Yeah, yeah. He's also. There are two producers. He's one of the producers. And because we want to save money for the film, we've cancelled one ticket. So he's taking care of the film. But thank you for being concerned. We'll tell him that you are you're worried. Say, sir. Yeah, he's also. Neelam Productions is his. Yeah, that... Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, please. He's, sir, uh, why do you think I'm so friendly with him? He has to pay him. There's one last payment that's got to come, so. <laughs> sir, sir, what? Sir, sir. I didn't do, sir, because I, last time I did, but a little. But what happened is this is, no, I did only little. I didn't do too much. The thing is, this is very authentic. We're trying to do that. If I dub, there'll be a little, you know, there may not, it not be pure. We want pure gold. So, Vikram sir, Vikram sir, Lily. I do real last question. Ah, last huh? okay. Real last question. <laughs> he get, he get, you're hello, a rock sir. star, man. Vikram sir, he get up early. Family, family sorry, reaction. Sir. Sorry, sorry. Fam she, you want to ask a question? Yeah. Family reaction. Sorry, sir. He get up early. My family reaction. My family. <laughs> they <laughs> they laughed. Answer madly. Huh? Answer. Yes, sir. They laughed, okay? They laughed, rolling laughter. But for that, how I will explain is, I have one hairdresser who is there. She's from North India, but she prays a lot and all that. So the first sequence he took was, I had a dhoti till here, no shirt. She didn't know this. She came and when she saw me and I had this gown, I took it off and I was not having a shirt. She was so, so shy, she was saying, sir, okay, sir, I'll, and I, I'm, yeah, okay, sir, I'm doing. And she was standing far away and, okay, done, no, no. He was saying, no, no, little more. 
said, okay, sir, okay, sir. That's the first day. Second day, third day, fourth day, my dress started going up till it became like that. She also, okay, sir, became okay, sir, okay, sir. Then in the end, I used to be wearing just that or uh, underwear and because five hours makeup, eight people, including her, were doing my hair. Everybody's working out, working on me. And there is one scene you saw on the thing where I wear clothes, like his, I'll be wearing shirt and pant in one in the, you see in the horse yeah. where I'm coming and with a gun also I come in the song. That day I was sitting there and they brought that costume. And she said, what is this, Vikram sir's costume? And she started rolling on the floor. You're going to wear that? And she's rolling. I said, Ozzy, you're actually finding that funny. Yeah, it's so funny. How will you? Because she got used to this other dress. So, I mean, I'm just saying. <laughs> that was very ironical. But I think between normal clothes and that, that's more comfortable. You should oh, wow. try it at home sometime. <laughs> Hi, Vikram Your sir. people will laugh at you. Don't bother. Try it. <laughs> Vikram sir, on your right. Here. Kirti yeah. Patil here from Vistara News. I knew everyone has already complimented you for the transformation that you have got you know, throughout the film. Uh, the trailer is really a breathtaking. I compliment for that. And I wanted to ask you, the question is, if you had the opportunity to collaborate with a Kannada film industry actor, whom would it be? Uh, whom would you uh, pick it up or prefer to work with? No, you, a, sir. A Kannada, a Kannada film actor or actress? Anyone, no. director, producer, an actress or an actor. Yash, Srinidhi Shetty, Prashant Neel. Okay, thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you. And they're all my friends, so I'm sorry. I was being a little... And Rakshit Shetty, of course. And, <laughs> and, and Shamira, if she's there to support oh, us. God. First. <laughs> she has been like... She interviewed us earlier, and we really love that energy. Thanks. You're doing a great job. Thanks. In fact, you're giving more PR than us for the movie. Thank you so oh, much. Thank very you. sweet of you. Means Danny so. is very impressed with you. I, oh, God. <laughs> All the way from London. And please, somebody, you need to ask him a yeah, question that's because what he's come all the way from oh. London to ask you, to answer your um, question. In Adhridhya, Prashne, Daniel Orike. Anybody wants to, yeah, yeah. Huh. yeah. And, and please ask him a question that will make India proud, okay? Yeah, question to Daniel, last one. Are they question, Barbeko, please? Yes. Yes. Ma'am, please. Uh, hi, Vikram. Uh, we all have seen that you have put a lot of effort and, oh, you know, hard work into the... <laughs> Actually, I had a question for you, yes. Okay, okay. Uh, I was waiting for a long time, but the mic that's did okay, not that's come okay. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, So, we all have seen that there is a lot of uh, hard work and efforts has been put into the film. But I wanted to know, uh, w which was the difficult part, uh, whether doing this film or making it reach to the people? <laughs> no, true answer, sir. <laughs> because you are asking all the right questions, all the right doubts. It's our duty to, you know, it's like his duty when he comes and says, you do this, why should I do? You tell me. I want to stand like this. Then when he said that shot, I say, I want to lie like this. No, sir. sir, Like that. You have to, we have to convince you when you ask a question. But I hope I answer. But, but then, on a serious, I mean, that was a funny thing. But seriously saying, I think, Doing this film or films like this is very difficult. But getting it to the audience is not difficult. It has to be enterprising and you have to be innovative. You have to try really hard because you're doing something very serious. And nobody wants a message and nobody wants to be raw. You want to give it to them. So how exciting can you be? It starts from the time he writes the story. Write well, make it exciting, make scenes that are engrossing and that you get, that you get them involved in it. Get performances that get people to believe that it's really happening. And then finally you have the film, but now you just have to tell them that this is what it is. And so give them little leaks, teasers, trailers, and the job's done. I hope we are doing a good job, or maybe should we try harder? Thank you very much. Yes, you have, super, thank you, yes. Ah. <laughs> wow. Uh, this is Ranganath from Nama KFI. You have also worked with Hollywood movies and uh, you have started your journey in uh, Indian films. So how uh, differences, wh what is the difference that you find actually uh, with the Hollywood movies and with the Indian movies that you have worked with? That's a very good question. Indian movies, like Indian culture, is energized, colorful, passionate, visceral. It's magnetic, it draws you in. It doesn't matter what film it is. There's always an underlying energy in Indian cinema. I think we've lost that in the West a little bit. I really do believe that. I feel that 
Indian cinema is on the verge of becoming the most powerful industry, film industry in the world. I think that is connected to cinema because, you know, as Chian's saying, you, you want to make that film, you know, cinema makers in India are thinking about the, those um, cinema going public who have to spend sometimes very hard earned money to go with their families to the cinema. You know, and they, they, want, to, they want to give them something. They, they want to give them something and make sure that people are coming to the cinema. So a filmmaker like Pa Ranjit has to think, I have to do something special. Whereas in the West, we've, we've lost a lot of our cinemas. It's become about streaming. So that's just content. So Indian cinema for me is still in an amazing place. You've got amazing filmmakers, a thriving cinema industry. It's exciting. And I feel excited, <laughs> genuinely, to be part of just a little part of Indian cinema history. And for, for Pa Ranjit to have cast a, a, a British actor who, for the, I, I mean, I've never seen it before. Maybe a lot of the media might correct me here, but I don't think I've ever, on anyone's ever told me that there's been a, a British parallel kind of lead uh, in an Indian uh, film. There's been lots of British actors, but the roles are usually <laughs> very similar and, and, and quite small. So Pa Ranjit had this vision about just, just you know, making things a bit more international. So that's really interesting. And I, I think Indian cinema is one step away. Once it goes international in terms of its storytelling, then there's nothing stop Indian cinema, it, Hollywood will, <laughs> it can't compete. You can't compete with Indian cinema. It won't be able to compete. The numbers won't be there because Indian cinema now internationally is getting the numbers as well. Uh, I hope that makes sense, just what I'm saying, yeah? Um, so, yeah, I'm really excited to have been part of this. Yeah, really. Thank you. Thank you so much once again. Yes. Modelne daagi namella madhyam mitrarigi amazing prashnegali goskara. Thank you so much. And team Tangalan, thank you so much. Bengaluru ke bandhu namma Sanjay namathishtu colorful madhuri. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.